Hello everyone, Terry Cruz here, and I'm Wooden Spoonie, and I will be here for the new commentating of the group for today's game. And that is right, this is where we are ready to prep things up. We've got the next team, and this is day two. Exactly that, Mike, as we all been ready to take on for the next two players in between the range of the Eastern Conference and the Western Conference of the game. As we are now, we've got the Washington Wizards of the D.C. of District of Columbia facing against the Miami Heat for the team of Jimmy Butler and Bradley Beal. The top team matches are going to turn out like they are going to go over and under. As right now, Chris Porzingis has already been traded with the Boston Celtics from the other side. As right now, we might be seeing what goes next for another new season to get the start off with the run. And exactly what we are doing, we're going to find out who they are. As for the starting lineups for the Washington Wizards, Monte Morris, Bradley Beal, Kyle Kuzma, Krista Porzingis, and Daniel Galford. On the other team for the Miami Heat, we've got Kyle Lowry, Tyler Hero, Jimmy Butler, Caleb Martin, and Bam on the bio, the tall man in the center. And now let's get you down to Son of Beast along with the commentating groups as we see Buller and OJ standing by at the Kaseya Center. It's a new new arena that has been rechanged from FTX Arena. That is correct. That's what we all turned out for anything that we have at all. I hope you enjoyed the game, and right now for the halftime show, we'll be the Kenny to Jet Smith and Check. No Neils. And we'll be back with the post-game show. That is right. Enjoy the next game, folks, and we'll see you all later soon. Peace out until the end of the fourth quarter. We are here now. The Miami Vice, home of the Heat, here at the Kaseya Center. As we're about to be seeing for this game from the Chris Sonic guy of the Miami Dade with the team of the Wizarding and the Home. It's going to be a tip off between Wizards and Heat. It's coming up right after this break. Hello everybody, this is Son of Beast, and we are here at the Kaseya Center in Miami. As right now with me, Boomer and OJ, this is NBA preseason of the 2K Sports. Here's Ali on the sideline. Well, Brian, the Heat are united, Coach Spolstra said, quote, it's not about stats with these guys, and that's so unique. You can talk about it, you can teach it, you can rant as much as you want, but this league is based on celebrating a lot of other things, and rightfully so, but ultimately, it's about winning. There it, is. there it is. That's what we all call for there. Thank you, Ali. And you know I'm definitely excited to see this one. It's all because of the game does happen now. I think this is going to be amazing. Yeah, pretty excited right now. All the fans are already here showing it up. Since we see him in season number three, this was happened the most of the time that KP was involved with the Wizards. But now, he's with the Celtics, and you'll see him next season with the Heat again. Because with the Celtics, it's all turned out to be one by one. Many to like. As for dislike, it will be hard not to get around with it. You know, no, nobody wants to do it this way because they really can't get away with that. They're really going to have to like try to fix something else if they can't get away with this one. That's how the piece comes up. Nobody wants that. You know, I must say, they're going to get over again. Here are the starting groups right now, all fueled up and ready to go. Porzingis is covered up by Butler, and Kuzma right over now, sorry, Kuzma on Butler, Beal is on Hero, KP on Bam on bio. it's Martin right over again to Monte Morris, and we have his Larry on Bradley Beal. Now I gotta say that Kyle Lowry is one of the biggest uh, players in the Star game. You know that Jimmy Butler was always the main, uh, main one of the best, because they were really showing it up like that. I can't just say that they were really that good. They were already been showing off. They want to hear it, and they got to make that one feel like they're comfortable right on the roll. Here's Gafford. Passes to Kuzma for the two. That rebound puts up by Adebayo. He has his first rebound of the game after a miss here for the Wizards. Here's Martin. In the corner now is Lowry. He passed to Martin. Now finds Butler. Here comes Butler. Toward the middle and drive. Makes a two-bucket score. 
Yeah, you always could say that Butler is always on the move. You make that one clear, you get it all. And what a terrific moment for the 2K TV drive presented by Mobile One. You know, that's how the spirit is. I can say that it was Jimmy Butler's idea. And, you know, a tough one is, nobody's idea with the game. I gotta say, it was a very one heck of a run. I love Butler's move. It's everybody's fan favorite with the duo. Feel shot, no good, and a two. There's no such a skating at the two if you really wanted to like try to mess them up. All of a sudden, it'd be because you gotta get that one right away. And you don't wanna leave up. That's the point. Nobody wants to get away with this. That's what it all turns out. Two pointer up and a foul. But call on KP. Porzingis gets with his first foul, and the Wizards will have their first team foul. Tyler Hero, one of the biggest players, and the rookie, and he's all in him. We believe that Tyler Hero can do it all. I know he does. Because Tyler Hero was a very uh, professional player after being a rookie of the year, he was already been showing like he wants to make the support out of him. With all the love and honor, you know, this is what everybody does. I'd like to see what Hero does for all. The best player it can get. First free throw sent in for Tyler Hero. You know, it's not the only set possible because they were really been keeping an eye on him. That's because of everyone's favorite favorite um, player of the guy that really does it all. They've got to make a commitment to him. He hits the second free throw. Here's Morris. He has the only two point of it was the bucket score after they put up a win against the Nuggets last season of the game on 2K23. It was all a toast turn out that they are unbelievable with overtime winning. Yeah, everybody's favorite. They have to say because Bradley Beal and the other team were really been showing it off like they did. I know it was a tough one. Because of that, they really loved it. Zero for three. Swish it in. That's where it starts off as Kyle Hero. Tyler, and Kyle Lowry with the assist. They already got in a lot of way. I want to know about how they did. It's a lot of key moment. Make that suggestion and just have it stand up. Kuzma on Butler. Three minutes to go on and Porzingis on Martin. Morris on Lowry with four seconds and a shot clock. Takes it over with the shot. Doesn't hit it out. Rebound put up by Gafford. He slams it down. And they will have a connection with the rebound put for the offense on the Wizards. They already had to say, they have already been lifting it out. You can't just say that they were. <coughs> excuse me. They really been showing it up that you And they can't get away with that. You don't want it to go flying on. Here's Lowry on the outside. Takes it back to Butler. Butler shoots over Kuzma. Two pointer makes it good for the team to beat the buck. shot clock violation. And now the timeout has been called by Washington with their first timeout with only 2.18 to go. You know Butler's been really incredible. He was only the main guy he can, and he loved it all. As you may have already noticed, guys, Jamie Jack Quest Jr. is also playing with the Heat. He is coming in for the, to show us support and love from UCLA with the team that does it for all. It's all I can definitely say about that. He's an amazing basketball player, and he definitely played with the uh, UCLA team in a Pac-12 conference. He definitely was a name in a consensus uh, for second team All-American. And you know he was a player of the year since the part as a senior in 2023. I know he was really amazing, but let me tell you this, when you're ever you're ready or not, you've got to love it. You have to show him what, what he's always going to play for, and he's going to be on the big time level. As you may have already noticed it there, guys, it's also Nikola Jovic. He's been traded off with the other team, and now he wants to go with the Heat. As you can't just tell him, why can't he play with the Blazers? Well, it's because of what definitely happens now. He was selected for Miami Heat. And that's why the Mega Basket was all it does. Kovic, ready to join with the Heat. There are two players coming in for the Heat, and let's make them proud. Oh yes, we love that one here. 
Hey, John DeQuest Jr., he's my favorite guy from the UCLA. I would like to see who else who can play or can get there for from the USC, University of Southern California. Here's all the deep finding over again. Vincent shot. Two pointer can't hit the mark. Oh man, he was almost gonna make it at that point. If he was gonna make the game for the two successful make, he would have had more time. No, it's not Vincent. Screen on that quest. And a foul will be called on Robinson. That's his first personal foul, their first team foul on Miami. With a minute and 45 to go. Now, you, you're never going to like that ball because the Kendrick Dunn was able to go with the, the put back in. He has that cut. Just enough to make that one pay for it. First free throw will be setting in for the Washington Wizards for their first sprint trip to the free throw line. And there will be out there to just to take away for the moment. Nobody has ever seen what's going on happen, but what do you think? What will they do for Washington and Miami? Well, I think Miami is going to get that with a lot of respect. I'm thinking they're going to clutch in for another playoffs because the Heat Nations are always like popping. White Heat names are a White Heat playoff mode. They really want that all. But the regular Heat, they don't have to worry about that anybody. And here's your take right now for the Washington Wizards. As you may already guessed it, they are just going to have to see what they can bring things up. And they definitely want to rise up. Wizards have to bring their next recruited player to try to step in the game. Do you think this will happen, OJ? Well, I don't know if they're going to definitely do it anyway. Probably they might just keep trying and then keep going again. They really got to show it off like that. Miami lead by three. Here's Love, right towards the outside, and now from back here is Oladipo. Oladipo finds Vincent and now gives off to Robinson. Trying to look for the cut. Looks to Butler, shoots around the off. That's good! Two-pointer for Butler, and now has three. An assistant here comes up from, from Robinson. A two-dynamic duo with the best player of the game. You can't say that, you can't feel it. You don't want to make that one feel like you're getting away with it. Now Mixon will have the possession, and now here's Love outside. Gives a bounce pass to Love to Vincent, and that will be a Butler and Old Depot. That will be Washington Ball with the first turnover on Miami. Washington trailing by five. Kispert right on Robinson. Toward the back was not. Washington are moving our ball around back and forth. Hold it from here. Kispert for two. I'll never miss by Washington. They are showing it off like that. They were going in and out. They just didn't really want to do this at all. But hey, you can't just make them feel like you're going to be out of in the game. Fades looks again. Good close call, but Kevin Love got a rebound. Oh, he will give it again to Robinson, and now go back to Butler. Takes it over, and a two-point scores in for Butler. He has eight. 13 and six is the score. Here's Wright. He will have it around or across from the angle of the corner. All alone. Advia missed a three-pointer outside. He was away alone. He was ready, but it seemed like he went missing. Two for Butler. Oh, he made it in! What a shot for Butler! Ten points, the end of the first quarter. You can't just say that. They were just going everywhere. What a two-point maker. Yeah, I gotta agree. Big time. And that concludes the first quarter. 15-6 run. We'll be back after this. And we are back here at Kaseya Center. Getting ready to start the second quarter. Miami had a great lead off to take from here. As we go from flashback in for the last part of a year in the finals, they made an unbelievable moment. Without Giannis Antetokounmpo, they are the best teams in the conference that definitely dug it all. They destroyed three teams in the Eastern Conference. The first round, Bucks, second round, Knicks, and third round in the, in the conference finals, the ultimate of the Celtics. How does it really take that the Butler and their team have it all squeezed down to go with the un unstoppable scorer, guys? 
Well, they really are starting to go right in between. I gotta say, this was a lot of a courtesy. Without Tyler Gira and her team, I think they're all showing the love and support. They have to believe on it. They can't just get away with this. Nothing can get around with him, and then you got it all coming down. Yeah, I really have to tell you now, Miami is a great team. Because of without, without the player getting overwhelmed, they just really loved it. They got to make that one a good clear on it, though. <laughs> this is what everybody loves. You got to step on it and get the game on. Here's Lowry, cut over from Morris. And we have a back personal foul called on Heat. Kyler Martin has his first foul with 5.03 remaining. Morris with the ball. Morris, screen coming in by Gaffer. Try to move in. That takes him away. Good team by Hero. It was nothing, but they were really doing it. All they have to do is to step him up. Struce in the corner. Oh my, rejection comes up by Kuzma. Says, take a look at this. Who's the boss now? Oh my, I don't know what to do with Kuzma. He had that corner right away, but he forgot to make that thing. Gaffer, pass to Kuzma on the corner shot. It's good, and Kuzma has a two-point bucket score. The assistant comes up here for another angle of the look. 4.15 left to go. Here's Martin. Back again to Lowry. Struis tries it again. He got a rim, but he didn't make the bucket score. Way deep pass to Kuzma. Struis on him, wants a fight for him. Nobody wants that. You don't want to leave him off. Hey, good tough shot right from here. And he's got assisted by Kyle Kuzma. After, after a play against Miami for four games of a season, this is whatever happens. Bradley Beal has a quote to make that one maintain. He says, the team is impossible. Nothing is going to kill me if I do the work. With the team of they have to do, this is what everybody does. And an offensive foul has been called on Kyle Lowry. That will be the second turnover for Miami. Oh, and a great rejection for Kyle Kuzma from corner one more time. I can't just say that Kyle Kuzma has already been looking like he was already on a good start. But that angle of this one keeps it from going outside. <laughs> it's honestly my opinion. Kyle Kuzma got the best defender here. Can't get away with him. Morris, pass it back over to Beal for three. Three-pointer off the mark. Struis will have his first rebound, and Tyler Hero on his way to the corner, find Bam on the bio. Good pass by Hero. On bio with the bucket, and he has two. First bucket of the night. That keeps him from way out of sight. You never get away with that easy. Under three minutes left to remain. Here's Gafford, and a foul, bucket and one. Gafford has his first one to take for the bucket score, and now he's at the trip, he's at the field trip to the line to shoot one. After Bam on a bio with the foul, as three players are checked out. Kispert comes in with right, as Kuzma moves over to point forward. The Heat are also making a switch here. Love on a point forward. Jimmy Butler back on the court, and Struis moves over to shooting guard position, coming in for Hero. And he will have it down. Just under three minutes to go in the second quarter of the first half, as Lowry will have it out. Now we'll have to give a screen and go. Takes it over. Charlie looks for the cut. Lowry up. Two-pointer, can't leave it away with him. He has his first bucket, finally have it out. And a Butler with the assist. That's a good connection feed off. That's what Lowry does. You just really have to make that one maintain it. Kispert back to right. Lowry on a pressure of the defender. Takes a D. And back over, Kuzma. Wow, what a scooping drive. Timeout will be called by Miami with only 2.13 to go. And you know, this is what everybody does. They want to upset their team. But the Heat team, no. They don't want that. They just really think that they want to win it all. 
And as you can tell that they already made it to the finals two times in a row from uh, 2020 and 2023. This is all that happened before. And yet I can't just say that Heat are the best yeah, option because everybody loves the Butler to beat over LeBron James's team. But in all that fact, it was definitely the hard part. Jimmy Butler has gotten a lot of uh, great responses. Let me tell you this. If he wants to do it again and take the finals MVP, he wants to do it all. What do you say? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> I don't think this may not happen that most of the time. It could be a little bit of a hard, hard angle or not. It may not it may be too much to do that. Can't let that fool you. Mm, it's going to be a very tough out, honestly, on my question to decide. Even like Florida Panthers made it into the Stanley Cup Finals. That's whatever happens most of the time. i got to make that one a good commitment. <laughs> Some new changes for the Wizards and for the Heat. Robinson is checked in, as right now, as Neil and Kuzma are checked out. Right now, we have his Porzingis and Nunn. Back again on the other side, we've got well, Oladipo and Robinson, along with Love. Here's, here's another one for Vincent. Back again to Butler, over again to Oladipo. Free for Duncan Robinson. I'll never miss by Miami. They're just getting away with that point. They don't want to leap off with the three pointers. Not going to happen this time. Double man defender and none has it all. It's a close game now, 21 to 17 to score. We seen it the last time in season three as the Wizards did beat against the Miami Heat. But now they don't want it. They got to get away with that. And because if nothing happens, you'll want to make that one feel uncomfortable. Here's a depot inside. Two-pointer connects. That will be his first bucket of the game. 23 to 17. Bright finds with Kispert. Looks over to Porzingis on Butler. Trying to get away with him. And he has no right to go. That is going to be a number two point for KP. It's not what everybody does. You don't want KP to get over this one. Butler, man oh man, he got a great drive. 12 points in the game, that's 9 for 10. And now here's Wright. We're under a minute to go, kiss for Don Robinson. With a two, step up, take back, rebound, oh, got burned. Had that one with the slam dunk, already been taken away from it. It's not I just saw. Gafford, oh my. Yeah, I don't know what to do, but uh, <laughs> get away with that. Vincent outside, fights again to Robinson, and now back, bounce pass to Butler. KP on it, back again to Oladipo. Six on the shot clock. Looks again, Robinson up. Goes reverse, and no good. Ten seconds, none for the way deep town. That's out of here. Oladipo finding again. Butler. Here he comes. Whoa! Oh my! I never see that one coming down. Butler just got a slam, and that ends the first half. 27 to 21 is the score. Got great buckets and range. We will be back with you shortly after this. Third quarter coming out after the break. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey everybody, good to see you back here on our Halftime Show. Well actually we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. Big time play throughout the first half for Jimmy Butler. He had 14 points and one assist. Kenny, let's get your take on my end. It's always a positive side to see a they're moving the rock with ease and keeping each other happy. It's a brand of unselfish basketball that's fun to watch. Jack, what was your takeaway on Washington? What impressed me the most was the effort they put into the offensive pass. Second chance points really added up to them. Fighting through box out, battling for position. They own the offensive players. And that's a wrap for our halftime show, the third quarter. 
just about to get started. All right, thank you guys. Now back to Son of Beast. We welcome you back in Miami at the Kaseya Center. We're about to start the third quarter. We all salute the wise player of Butler. His ultimate team has been turning it out after a trade-off back in 2020. As for the 2019-20 season, he's the main man to be on for anything. Hot hands. Yeah, it's the guy. I gotta love him. This guy. The feeling? Lovable. It's all the motion it is. And you have to know for the fact. I have to go with the, the best player in the world. Can't get away with the top 10 priority. Rebound puts up by Anabayo. Here's Hero, he will have it on the court. And he's on KP. Then we have Morris on Lowry. Martin is right toward again, Don Gaffer. Kyle Kuzma is on Butler. And finally we have, we have, it's Anabayo. He's with another, another player, right in bound the Adebayo had gotten a great one. I gotta make that one a good connection call. That was an excellent mobile one drive of the Adebayo. Here's Morris, passes to Beal. Here's Morris back again on Lowry. Passes to Gapper. Tries to hold on to him. Kuzma on Butler. Screen on its way. Holds it through. With a two. Chucked it by Bam on a bio. That's his first block of the night. Oh, you gotta make that one feel good. Because Bam, you blocked that out of here. Oh yeah. I love the defender taking away from it. Kuzma finds Porzingis in one hand dunk down. That's a pass that goes with another assist of the game of the Wizards. They're just coming back down by six. And now here's Butler. Passes over to Martin. Back again to Lowry. Fade a shot. Gotta find some room. Hero back again. Free for Butler. Outside the range. Makes it in. As Hero with the assist. It's all it does happen to me. I can't just really say what it goes down with. They always been looking at the strong. They gotta get it all. The timeout's been called by Washington with only 4.11 to go. And this is turning out a biggest game of the night. When I can't just say that they were really going to have to try to make the timeout calls, fix the plane. Gotta go with the different ideas. If you don't want to mess this up, you just gotta like, change it. That's all you can get there just right away. And don't worry about that. Everybody does it for all the time. Can't go out all alone. Yeah, it's because I really just enjoyed what the most of the players, the highlights motion. But I have to say, Bam on a bio really does it all. You have to feel it. Everybody love it. And they have to believe on them that you can't get away with it. The NBA preseason of 2K24 is brought to you part by Mountain Dew. Let's do the do. Adidas, the official brand of the NBA. And by State Farm. Talk to an agent today and get a free quote at 1-800-STATE-FARM. Here are new changes here as right now, all four couple players are checked out for Wizards and for the, and for the Heat. IBR and Porzingis switching up in the center. Here's Beal. Two-pointer can't get away with it. Adebayo has his fifth rebound of the night and now goes right back to Euro. Lowry in the corner. The screen. And we have a report from Ali LaForce. He had made his talk to Eric Spolstra. All he does say, it was all that happened. And can't just get away with that. He said, we've got to make a good connection work. I have to feel it to improve them to go with their own. And not get away with this one. Because if you do, it doesn't help to stand at all. That's because the team never stands out and can't just leave unmarked. they got to make a talking connection in between, and they've got to do it all. Yeah, that's pretty much all I can say right now. Because if you don't have a good point, you might need to go with a different changeup. Now, it's all that true, it is. 
Amari on the outside, passes again to Butler. Butler pass to Lowry. Up for the three. Take it back. He's all alone in the corner. Good. He's on fire tonight. 20 points in the game. Morris right back to Lowry and now find Kuzma. Marinon Adia. Beal. Screen on KP. Here's a two. Good D by Bam on the bio. When he bit that rebound, you've got to shut them down. That's what I know for. That Butler sent two and jam down after Adebayo's assist. Yeah, I can just say about Bam on the bio have a good pass off to Butler. He's a he's a legendary. You can't just get away with him. You make him feel like you never know. Him. Here's Kuzma. Pass to Adebayo. Out of the out of Kuzma. Screen on KP. Kuzma. All alone. Wide open shot. And that calls for the loose ball on the Wizards. Adiva has his foul. And one more block for Bam. The out of bio rejection. Yeah, it's tough to clear. I can just say that he had got a great stop out of it. And Bam on bio. He had a lot of heavy competitions between Joel and B. KP, and definitely, of course, the real guy, Adebayo. Two minutes remaining, as right now, Lowry will have it over. Struess, right from the corner. Lowry back here away, over now to Hero. Hero with the step move. Tough shot, but he makes it in. He has nine points in the game. 41 to 25 is the score. Wizards making another timeout call with a minute and 44 to go. They have to show them off because they need some help. That's what they have to do. Can't lose it all. And as for now, this is what everybody does. Here are the full game schedules as right now. They're in between for the lineups of the group. As right at this moment, we do have one of each standing by. As you may already notice, they're four. Because of what they have to do is to get right from here. And as the games are standing by, we have one of them. Here they are. Let's have a look and take what they schedule right on the board. The 2K24 matchups. Grizzlies versus at Raptors. Hawks at LA to face against the Clippers. Then the Pistons at Detroit at Charlotte with, with the Hornets. OKC Thunders at Denver to play against the Nuggets. The Kings at Cleveland to play against the Cavaliers. The Nets at Phoenix to play against the Suns. Mavericks and the Rockets of the Texas Showdown from at Houston. Wizards at the other team of Utah of the Jazz. Warriors at New York to face against the Knicks. The Wolves against the Orlando Magics. Lakers at Philadelphia to face against the Sixers. Bucks at Chicago facing the Bulls. Pacers at New Orleans to play against the Pelicans. The Blazers at San Antonio. And finally, Miami at Boston Celtics. That will be tonight's game with a presentation to the start of the opening night here for the teams. So get ready and we will see what happens, what the team does. I like when KP does it out at all. It's the layup drive. He doesn't want to get away with this. You don't want to leave it off. Hero passed his troops. Now Butler will have it here. Give it off to Love. Try to leave open. Makes a give and go. Low. Step back with a two. Oh, man, he's good. Love has his first bucket. And Butler with the assist. You just have to say that Kevin Love was over there like, what? Wow, legendary you can build. Here's nine. Back to Struis. 50 seconds to go in the third quarter. Over with the two. Pull it back. And a foul called on Bam on bio. That's his second personal. And another team foul from the Miami. 44.4 seconds of KP will be at the free throw line shooting too. They're adding another field trip to the free throw lines for the Washington. And they just never got a lot of them before. Yeah, that's because of what they do. KP just really said, it's enough. I don't want to hear this one. Make the swap out of it. 
that feels uncomfortable, and I will have a tough time shooting it. Yeah, nobody wants that one. <laughs> no way. First free throw good for KP. And you know how KP does. He played with the Dallas Mavericks here before. He's transferred off to Washington, and now he's ready to go out to go back to the East Coast. He's with the other team to go in from the, from the upper tri-state area, right in between for the free. Massachusetts, New York, and Connecticut. Here's Butler, we will have his chance. Pass to Love. Love back again to Butler. Here's Hero on the outside with the drive. Good to go. Hero has 11 and Butler with the assist. That's how it does turn out. Hero really delivered it all. He's the one of the biggest kid in town. Kispert on Butler. Counts pass to none. 20 seconds remaining as right now Kispert in the middle. And he's fouled and that calls for love. And that's another team foul on Miami. And now Kispert will have to leave out with the free throw line shooting too. You know that it doesn't really mean that Kispert doesn't have it all the protection. It's because how want he how he really wants to do. He has to go with the good look. He was in the middle. Nobody's going to have to uh, take him out of here. You can't just make him knock down. That's going to be a little bit, a lot of hard brutal to have him on the court. And the two shots coming up for Corey Kispert. He's going to have it all to take his time. Kispert hits the first free throw. KP shut down as Monte Morris is checked in. There, as Gafford is checked in, excuse me. Second free throw is good for Kispert. They're just trying to get back into this game. Nowhere to go, they can't leave behind. Not even all, and nobody can. Struess now finds zero. Ten seconds to go. Here's Butler. Try to go with the cut. Turn the corner on the paint. Rebound. Love up. And count it. Love makes the bucket. 47 to 30 wins the score. And they are on a full heat night in Florida. Yeah, that's what they all do. Miami Vice does it all again. We come to the end of the third, and the fourth quarter is coming up after the break. You're watching the NBA 2K24 preseason on 2K Sports. Be back after this. It's been a wild night, as Miami is already like the best teams in the Southeast Conference in the ranking, as making things on the best one to bring out tonight. And now, we are ready for the fourth quarter. For the final group presented by Gatorade, we are set and good to go. Carl Lowry is with, uh, with uh, Monte Morris. And Beal on Hero. Martin is on Kyle Kuzma. And it's Love, right on the other side. With Gaffer. And finally, we have Duncan Robinson on Kispert. Here's Kispert right in the middle. Outside look, Morris rolls it up, and Gafford slams it down. That will be another major credit to give that one a good dunk. I don't know what to tell you because Gafford was really simply he was to say, I'm reaching it, and I did it. That's because everyone knows it for sure, OJ. You know that's the thing. Yeah, big facts. Here's Zero with the ball now finding again to Lowry. Here's Robinson on outside with only five to shoot. Hero, way deep, not enough to make him maintain. Another miss for the free for Miami, and now Morris has it back. Kispert with the ball, finds Kuzma, and that will go over Martin. Number two pointer for Kyle Kuzma to come back down, 49-35 game. Larry looks over Martin, pulls it over to Gary Law. 
keep making new changing with the ball movement on the outside and in. Love goes over Gafford and two in the paint. Six points right now, and Morris has it with the possession as the Wizards has to get them back. Morris on Larry. Give it off to Kispert for three. Take back. Excellent D. Morris on Larry. Four minutes gone by in the fourth quarter. Screen on Kuzma. Looks it up. The drive is sent in for Kispert. They're just coming down that big. That's what nobody does. I just never see what's going on. But hey, don't let them go deep. They can't get away. Another huge perfection area on another mobile one drive for the Wizards. As Kispert got a great layup. Here's Hero. Ball loose. And taken away by Beal. Monte Morris just saw that it was a takeaway for Beal. Great steal. A lot of reaches to take over. I never see what's going on like this. Wow. Ball's off the rim. And a foul's on Hero. 326 remaining in the fourth. Now another one comes in for the Wizards at the free throw line. They're making another trip here as Monte Morris taking two shots. There's just no way to get luck out of that. You really never want to leave here. That's just whatever happens. Morris misses the first free throw. And they're going to take another deep change. As right now, Kispert's checked out and KP's checked in. Miami Heat is also making a new changes as Oladipo is checking in for Tyler Bureau. And two free throws miss. Here comes Oladipo around Kuzma. Nice team protection for Kuzma. He has another rebound down and now Beal is on look. Looks it over. Ankle breaking out. They are just coming back in to make a number one. Nobody has it all. Bradley Beal, he's already been stepping in again. Never leave him out. Right now, the time has been called by Miami with only 3.12 to go. They're going to need to see what they can do to try and change it up. It's hard enough to make it sometimes. But you don't want to leave him out to just, like, take it away from each other. You just really have to go on with the flow. Nobody has it all. They just have to keep on going and right around them. The Anime Saturday Invitational is going to be happening with the final four contestants. So, if you would like to support which one do you think is going to win, here's your options. As of right now, there's a lot of them that they are changing it up. There's only a few po people that voted for Silver Spoon. For, for placing the matchup here to make that next one might be Nickel. Second people have just making it a little bit of range, but close battle call of Cabby. And I'm thinking most people are choosing Ben Cross as Blue. Who do you think is going to win? Well, I'm not sure who are they. But you know what? I have a deal, so it might be Blue, but I'm going to have to, like, prove it all. That's my that's my thing that I want to choose for. I think it is going to make that one a successful win. And what about you, Blue? Who do you think will win? Well, I'm not even sure. I might have to just say it's, it's going to be a lot of range. I have to say, Gabby might be a fan. And I have it all with this, with the, all the good thing to keep on going. All right, guys, thank you so much, guys. Martin finds again Lowry. Pass back to Butler. Butler over Kuzma, and he made that one a good feed off and a layup. 24 points, and Lowry with the assist. Beal on his way down. Trying to move around. Oladipo on Beal, screen on KP, over again, take back, up again, no, two, oh, what a dunk jam, just come back in close, you just can't get away with this, Chris Porzingis is just like a porous thrower, not enough to go with the own. Lowry pass again to Oladipo, here's again Donna Bio. tries again, now we'll make a cutoff this time. And take Flecked And takes it away. Here comes Gaffer. 
Gaffer passes to Kuzma. Two minutes to go. Three pointer misses again. Oladipo finding Butler. And Butler all alone. Two a jam. It's all with the eyes on him. The tired run just can't get away with it. I know Jimmy Butler is always a great guy. 26 points, he's going to be a star. Here's Beal on Oladipo. Missed again. Oladipo trying to make his way down, and now Butler decides it's go time. Here's Oladipo, cornered up. Three for Butler. Misses again. A good look at open, but now Kuzma will have his time to go with another look. Drive sets in right now for Kuzma. 55 43 is the score. A lot of combinations in between. Kyle Kuzma have eight and 26 for Butler. They're all even showing up. What do you think? I love that Butler has it all hustled down. He have to say. Believe it or not, they're all can't get away with it. And I just have to say, they were really a tough one, Artis. Can't go around it. Butler, feeding over Kuzma. He has 28. One minute left to remain. And their team of the Heat are on wild. Free for Beal. Another miss again. And take away from that, here comes KP. Porzingis, double man. Finding Gaffer. Oh! That quick turned out to be another dunk. And Monte Morris with the assist. That's not how it goes. One time pass and a dunk. They just really have to go with the quick timing release. Martin finding again. And Butler. Suits over Kuzma. Has Moody! He just finally delivered it up. They all believed it. That's what Butler's favorite guy is to play with the heat. Nobody has it all down. You just don't have the right to do. You have to trust and proceed him. He's the best. Kuzma on Butler. Step back for the two. Rebounded. Right over again. And the two-pointer will hit it in. And that will do. Miami wins the game. 59-47. to a great comeback score rally. They are just turning it up the heat. The process does it all in town. I don't know what to say. But it's all can take what you want. And a chance now for to send you over to Ali LaForce for Butler. Amazing score perfection. Hey, Ali. Hey, these Miami fans, they are so appreciative of the effort that you guys displayed tonight. Talk about what they mean to you. Uh, we couldn't do it without uh, Appreciate you guys. Uh, continue to support us. Do the ups and downs. We appreciate y'all. Thanks so much, Tyler. All right, thanks, Allie. And that's about wraps it up. With me, Senator Beast, Allie LaForce, along with Boomer and OJ, this has been a presentation of the preseason of the NBA 2K24. There will be more on its way with the last game left and then the tip off. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful night in Miami Vice. All right, thank you so much. Appreciation always deserves for you, Senate Beast, as Miami takes a win with a 59-47 score. A lot of hustle and bounding. I've, I've got a lot of feelings for Jimmy Butler. He was a great man to have it all in case. Just a lot of perfectionary in between for the two, and the range was not successful. They've got a lot of tons of uh, baskets made in between for the, for the two. But there's a lot of misses that they were going to have to like get away with that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's always definitely turned out. A lot of missing free pointers for the Washington Wizards. Disappointing effort that they can't take. And it's not going to be easy enough. You don't want to make that one mistaken. With only 30% for Miami Heat. 64% for the field goals. And they've got 8 fast break points. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty honest to clear that one. Miami's only the biggest tough ones that they already made their way to the playoffs to the finals. For the second time in the game since many years ago here and back in 2013 and 2014 was the last one that they definitely made. It's a course they bring up a one of a kind. Four points in the paint that turned out to be 34 right in between the two. Second chance points was 14 for the Wizards. Bench points was eight, evened up. 25 assisted run Miami Heat. They've always been turning out that great. Offensive rebounds is bringing up 13 for Washington. And then four steals. 
for the Wizards too. One box in between. No turnovers as it only had six for them for Miami Heat. Too many turnovers, they were calling offensive fouls. They were nothing to gonna get there. A turn to be off and too many. One one team foul has been already been turning out to be Washington Wizards. Seven dunks performed. 18 biggest lead for Miami Heat. And time possession was 12-18. That was all it turned out. Biggest star of the game. And now it's time to present your free star players of the game. Wooden Spoonie, you're up first. Thank you so much. First star of a player, as we stopped here for the, for the night, it was all turned to be, all it doesn't have to go with the worry to go all, Daniel Gafford. 11 points, 10 rebounds, 2 assists, 2 steals, and 4 dunks. Excellent 15 performance run, and turned out to be one of the biggest, uh, in, the, in all of the courts that turned out to be one of the greatest. It's all because of him, he does it for all, he has a team out, it's presentable, not the facts that we all take for. He's all amazing odds, that's what you can all trust for. Now to you, for the next player, Danny, uh, Terry Cruz. Alright, thank you so much. Number two, as we go right in from here, this calls for Chris Stapp for Zingas, KP for short. He only had made 12 points, 6 rebounds, 2 dunks, and 12 performance run. That was his definite take, but as all as he knows for, he just really had a lot of fight back with the rebounds. That was crazy enough, and took one hand dunk, dunk down, not even anybody can score big here. And now for your number one New Balance player of the game, that's right, Mr. Jimmy Butler. 30 points, he was all in good position, got great rebounding and free assist, he just got great total crazy scores in the making of the game. 36 performance run, 3 dunks, all does turn out 14 out of 18 field goals. It was all his fan favorite, and it's incredible to have him back on the court. And as appreciation, that was it for the first game. Stay tuned as we have our final game in the Western Conference of the game. We were about to see the LA showdowns right in between during the possessions. But they're not always importantable that they can never get away with that. The last two in possession can take over bump everybody that can do it for all. And as we're being standing up, we will see how this one goes from in between the last two times. So with that being said, Terry Crews and Wood Spoonie along with the 2K Sports crew, thank you for so much for watching, and as always, peace out folks, and see you later for a while as the NBA 2K24 preseason dial. And we hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to his channel and follow him on his medias. Links are down here in the about page to bring things on. And that will be everything on the media. See you all again later for the last game of the Western Conference. And until next time, good night in Miami Dive. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.